We now give a categorical structure to the collection of monad lifts of eilenberg moore categories and monad extensions of Claisley categories. Recall how conjugate pairs compose horizontally. This was given in our playlist on the joint situations. Precisely if delta psi and delta prime psi prime are conjugate pairs for the respective squares, where the vertical functors are in a joint situation, then k delta delta prime h prime psi prime h k prime psi is a conjugate pair for the horizontal composition of squares. We then use this result to define composition in a category of monad lifts. So if the top squares are eilenberg moore lifts of Q and P through UR, US, and US, UT respectively, with delta and delta prime the left mates of the identity natural transformations, then by definition, lambda is equal to US delta and gamma is equal to UT delta prime as the corresponding natural transformations to the lifts above them. Then using the horizontal composition of conjugate pairs above, we have P tilde delta delta prime Q as the left mate of the identity natural transformation with respect to the top square, and P lambda gamma Q as the corresponding natural transformation from T P Q to P Q R. We define the metacategory of monad lifts, which consists of a monad T, and the category E it is defined on as objects, and morphisms as pairs p tilde p, which is equivalent to lambda p, where p tilde is an eilenberg moore lift of p through us ut, and lambda is the corresponding natural transformation defined as ut delta, where delta is the left mate of the identity as described on the left. Then we have two equivalent descriptions of composition, where p tilde p, which is equivalent to gamma p, followed by q tilde q, which is equivalent to lambda q, is p tilde q tilde pq, which as we have shown to the left is equal to p lambda gamma q pq. Then since horizontal composition of commuting squares is associative and the identity functors act as the identity morphisms for this category, we see that our definition gives a well-defined categorical structure on monad lifts. Similarly, if the top squares in the following are Claisley extensions of Q and P along FT, FS, and FS, FR respectively, with psi and psi prime as the right mates of the identity natural transformations, then by definition, sigma is equal to psi FT and tau is equal to psi prime FS as the corresponding natural transformations to the extensions above them. Then using the horizontal composition of mates above, we have psi prime q hat p psi as the right mate of the identity natural transformation with respect to the top square, and tau q p sigma as the corresponding natural transformation from p q t to r p q. We then define the metacategory of monad extensions, which consists of a monad t and the category e it is defined on as objects, and morphisms as pairs q hat q, which is equivalent to sigma q, where q hat is the Claisley extension of q along ft fs, and sigma is the corresponding natural transformation defined as psi ft, where psi is the right mate of the identity as described on the left. Then we also have two equivalent descriptions of composition in this category, where q hat q, which is equivalent to sigma q, followed by p hat p, which is equivalent to tau p, is p hat q hat pq, which is equivalent to tau q p sigma pq. And by the same logic as for monad lifts, this is a well-defined categorical structure. And finally, note that there are canonical forgetful functors from the metacategory of monad lifts to the opposite metacategory of all categories and from the metacategory of monad extensions to the metacategory of categories, where both project the second component. Note that these are one categorical functors, and we are not yet discussing anything about the two categorical structures involved.